All right, as I mentioned previously, uh, you can get quite a bit of material uh, removed from these exhaust port openings to a gasket match, uh, these, these exhaust runners. So this one, I've already ground on it and gasket matched it. This one over here, you can see hasn't been done. Uh, I don't have any die cam or um, what they call machinist blue. So I just uh, used a regular old Sharpie. Um, but like I said, you can get quite a bit of material out of these uh, exhaust ports. So I'm gonna keep working on this. I've made quite a bit of progress. I got this intake runner ported out. Still gotta uh, machine my little flat spot in there. But these exhaust runners are finished. So we've got number one cylinder finished, number two cylinder finished, number three cylinder finished, and number four cylinder is halfway finished, the intake port's done, and I'm working on these two, uh, the number four, number five exhaust port. So I'll keep working on this and uh, I'll keep uh, shooting some video. So I just have a few things left to do here on this cylinder head. I'm pretty much finished uh, porting out all the, uh, the intake and the exhaust runners. Uh, one thing I got to do, it did get sprinkled on. Uh, you got a little bit of rain, even though it's under the carport here, it does leak a little bit. So it did get a little bit sprinkled on. It's got some surface rust. I can knock that off uh, with just like a scotch Brite pad. So that's one thing I got to do. The other thing is what I'm set up for now is to make the cut here. And this is the uh, number five, number six intake port. And I got to do the same here. Uh, for the number three and number four intake port, and I've already done uh, the number one, number two intake port. So uh, we're going to make this cut again, make a flat surface here for our bolt. So I got to do that, and then I need to uh, tap out these top holes. I'm going to use a 3 8 MPT tap, uh, tap that in there so I can put a uh, like I'm just I'm probably just going to use a brass uh, pipe plug in there. So uh, anyway, I'm all set up here. Uh, let me get the camera set up and we'll get started uh, milling this little flat area on this intake runner. All right, I got this one done here on the uh, number five, number six intake port. Uh, if I have to criticize myself, I probably made this one a little too wide going across, but nonetheless, it is definitely flat. And the bolt goes in there nice and easy. So this one's done. Just gotta come over here, do the uh, number three, number four, uh, the floor of that flatten that out and then like I said tap out these holes up here to put a little brass pipe plug in there and uh, we'll be ready to bolt this back on the onto the engine. <laughs> 